Choose to not be first. Do we do enough? Well, I never shut up about it. Uh, it must have been about 17, 16, 17. We nicked their guilt ring. Right, the bouncer's guilt ring. This is no good for me. That's the reality. If you want the honest truth, and I see it every day. Umar Ahmed, IFL TV. Johnny Fisher's just having his water after a brutal stoppage win over Harry Armstrong. Just talk me through that finish. That was emphatic, Johnny. Great finish, but to have a good fight, you've got to have a good dance partner, and what a dance partner Harry Armstrong was. Um, great ring walk as well. I was dancing along to his ring walk. What a tough man. I thought he could have gone in the first, but testament to his ambition and toughness, what a good fight it was. I mean, yeah, looking at the fourth round, uh, you probably should have had a knockdown there, Johnny. What were your thoughts on that? Yeah, I saw him hit the ropes, and I thought... I'm, he warned me, the ref, before the fight, um, don't hit him when you're down. Because I remember once in my third fight against Danny Whitaker, I accidentally came through and fin threw another, another shot. So, not that I was holding back, but I was mindful of that as well. Um, but yeah, I thought if you hit the ropes and it keeps you up, it's a knockdown. But it doesn't matter because I got him out there in the seventh. Johnny, Harry Armstrong was being touted for Fraser Clark uh, for his last fight before he stepped in with uh, Marius Wack. So, that was the opponent level they were looking for someone like Marius Clark. Uh, for uh, Maris Clark, for Fraser Clark, uh, you've got your chicken balls there. So to, to get rid of um, Harry Armstrong like that, do you think that sends out a bit of a statement uh, to, the, to the domestic division? I'm not bothered about sending out statements to anyone. I'm bothered about my career. And Harry Armstrong put on up a great fight, and I'm interested in putting on good fights for people. That's what I did tonight. Fraser Clark sparred him for this camp. We got some great work in. He's in a great place as well, and he's got a really good fight with Dave Allen. Mm. And I know both of them blokes very well, so um, I'm wishing them all the best, and Fraser Clark's looking great. Was that the perfect sort of opponent for you tonight? Uh, I suppose so, because of the finish and the fight, he gave me some rounds. Um, a few people, Barry Earn said you've been in a proper fight there, which is great. And I think you saw the best of me with some body shots and some, some good hooks and things like that. So, yeah, it was, it was a great opponent. But, um, yeah, I'm, I'm happy with that. Do you think it could have been stopped a little bit earlier, Johnny? Um, it's a title fight, isn't it? So you want to give the other guys as much credit as they, they possibly can. But yeah, it could have been stopped when I was maybe two or three punches earlier. But the referee done a great job, really clear to us before the fight. And it's up to the referee. I'm not trying to do the referee's job. That's what they're for. Obviously, his face was very bloody. I don't know how he is. Did you hear if he's all right? I saw him afterwards, he seems all right. He's just got a little cut, I think. I don't know if it's from a punch or... But um, he's good, and I saw Don Charles as well. Yeah. Um, great guys they are. I remember we sparred Bill and Smith together a few months back in for his fight with Akoli. And yeah, I've known Harry for a long time, been around the same circuit, circuit sparring Joe Joyce. So I know he's tough, he's really tough. So I'm really happy with that victory. Those haymakers going in as well, just at the end. Just talk me through that, Johnny. Bosch makers. Bosch it, makers. Bosch makers. Um, yeah, it was good, but I just thought. I've got to get my distance right. I knew my distance weren't quite right because Mark was saying as well, scuffing over the top. I'm more guilty of that in the past, but I knew if I just brought my feet in and shortened it up a little bit, I'd do it. But I thought I've got to throw some leather and give him something to think about as well. But it's all learning in, in the process of becoming a, a good se season professional, and I'm just starting that. To not be proof. Do we do enough? Well, I never shut up about it. Uh, it must have been about 17, 16, 17. We nicked their guilt rings. Right, the bouncer's guilt rings. This is no good for me. That's the reality. If you want the honest truth, and I see it every day.